What's up lovers? Welcome back to the Bondi Sands YouTube channel. I am Sarah's Day and I'm a health and fitness guru and YouTuber. I have a bunch of products like activewear and in health and beauty products and I'm also a new mum to my beautiful little six month old Fox. I nearly called him Foxy but I was like that's not his name. <laughs> Today I'll be showing you how I apply the brand new Aero Liquid Gold. This is pretty much like the Bondi Sands classic liquid gold tan, but in an aerated formula. So the reason I like this one, I'm a beach girl and I like when my skin is dewy, sun-kissed, glowy and summery, and this is absolutely perfect for that. Being a busy mom, there's literally nothing worse. There's a few things worse, but one of the worst things about tanning is if I'm really sticky and I have to wait to wash it off because with a baby, it's just not practical. So one of the best things about this is, is there's no dark color guide. You can apply it and it's going to develop over six hours. So you don't have to wash it off. So you can chuck your clothes on, there's no transfer. It smells like coconuts, which Kurt loves because if I smell like tan, he will tell me. And if you know anything about me, you know I love hydration. I'm like notorious for moisturizing like too many times in the day. But one of the things I love about this is there's argan oil actually in the formula. So it's gonna make your skin feel beautiful and glowing and soft, and it actually makes your tan last longer as well. So without further ado, let's get into the actual tutorial and get me looking like a golden goddess. So my hair is in a bun, which means we mean tanning business. Now my year 10 self, I wish I was listening to me because finding a mitt is game changing. In the tanning world, you need a mitt. There's nothing worse than, first of all, getting an orange hand when you tan or finding streaks on your tan. So number one, get yourself a mitt. So I like to start off with my legs because when you're like leaning down, you don't want to be getting tan everywhere. So I feel like do your legs first and then do your upper body separate. I always wish I worked in an ice cream parlor, but this is close enough. Oh baby. Oh, I mean, come on. That's just beautiful. Look at that. I start with my shins and like my calves. I just kind of get a base around the whole calf and shin. And I don't do my knee at this point. I kind of just like go around my knee because your elbows and your knees are kind of like the dry part. Ugh. Ugh. And then I just go down my foot. There's nothing worse than you have like a strip of tan and like a white foot or like white hands. Learn from my mistake, gals. Learn from my mistake. And then we're going to move on to the thighs. The part that I really like. I'm always white here. No matter how tanned I get, it's like my inner thighs refuse to tan in the sun. But this year I'm getting better and I'm just gonna fake tan more because I'm a mum, you guys. The older I get, my skin's just not the same and I wanna protect it. I need to create like a weekly tan routine so I don't tan in the sun because we all know how bad that is. Buffered in, circular motion. Maybe I should start a makeup channel. Listen to my jargon. So make sure you get your booty. And then I don't reapply onto the mitt. I just use any of the remnants to do my knee cap. Because like I said, this is a, often a dry part of your skin, so it's going to hold on to the color. So you just wanna do like a really, really light layer. Now with this product, it does develop over six hours, so you're not going to see an immediate change. You can see that it's more dewy and glowy because of the argan oil, but you are going to see the final effect after six hours. To really get that left glute, you've gotta to commit to the left hand. And I'm just like, look at this, look at the awkwardness. I just, my left hand and my brain, I don't think they're connected. I have to use this hand to really get in there, you know, get into the booty, but I'm not gonna lie if I say I'm not struggling. Guys, just saying before I get onto my upper body, I literally just did my legs and they're already dry. Like I could put jeans on and be totally fine. Love that, love that for us. Now onto the arms. I do it very similar to my legs where I do like those long strokes, but remember, treat your elbows like your knees and don't go over them with like a bunch of tan because it's gonna hold on to the color. But I will say guys, it's just so light. Like look, you can tell it's like, <gasps> do you know what it's like? It's like marshmallow fluff. Yes. If you want a visual about what this feels like or like, an example that you can imagine, it's like marshmallow fluff, but for tan. It's like super, super light, not sticky, and it smells like summer, like coconut. Oh, yes, I love this. Number one, no orange sheets because no transfer. Number two, smell like coconut, you're welcome. The smell of summer. Again, going back to my year 10 self, I used to always forget this like under tricep bingo wing area, you know what I mean? So make sure you get that because like if you're in a club, hands in the air, like you just don't care. If you have a white strip, like that's just a dead giveaway that you're not a natural summer goddess. You've had some help, okay? We're just trying to make people think that this is our natural glow. Because I've kind of finished with whatever's on my mitt. I get the remnants and I put it on my hands. I pretty much go down to my knuckles and this side. Don't forget this side of your wrist. Cause like if you have an awkward cutoff, again, dead giveaway. I don't know if everyone else does this, but I also do my underarms with the remnants because 
I'm a hands up kind of girl. Like that's the way I dance, you know, I get into the moves. And then I actually end by doing the way my hairs go. I feel like, I don't know, I feel like it's, it blends nicely. Like if I leave it circular and buffed, I don't know, maybe it's just me. I just like to go the way my arm hairs go. <laughs> so I'm gonna do my chest now or my decolletage. I'm always in bikinis or like lower cut tops or just like chill open shirts. And this is the part where it's like, you look at people and you're like, you've been in the sun or like you're looking summery and glowy. I love a good glow on my collarbones. So I'm probably gonna go like crazy with this here. So I'm just gonna get a good amount. Oh, that'll never get old. Like I just love doing that. I am breastfeeding. Like I said, I'm a new mom. I have a six month old little fox. So I would usually like go ham and go like hardcore on the boobs. But now, you know, I've got to be conservative because his face is down there quite often. So I'm just gonna do kind of like a straight line. Oh my gosh, it's like the perfect match of tan and moisturizer. Even though I'm in the gym and I'm like fit and like moving around, I'm a lazy human. Like if I can skip a step in life, I'm gonna do that. So this is like tanning and moisturizing in one. Like, can you see that? Look at that glow. Am I allowed to say that about myself? Yes, yes, I love it. Do like round buffing motions. Now I know what you're thinking, wearing a white robe after tanning is not very smart, but this is what I mean. There is no transfer after you tan with the Aero Liquid Gold. So this is going to develop into its true color in six hours. That's when I'll be looking glowy, summery, and goddessy, like I've just stepped off Bondi Beach. So if you've tanned in the morning, you can totally leave it six hours and then wash it off. But for me, I'm just gonna sleep in it and then have my morning shower. So I will see you guys bright and early in the morning. Good morning, lovers. It is the next day. I washed it off this morning. And with the Aero Liquid Gold, your first shower, there's going to be no like runoff. Your water isn't going to run off brown like a normal tan because there is no guide color. And because it does have argan oil in the mixture, my skin was still really glowing and moisturized and soft. Still, I do like to top it off with the Bondi Sands moisturizer because I feel like it makes my tan last a little bit longer. So the Aero Liquid Gold lasts for up to 10 days because it has two types of tanning ingredients in there. So you just have that beautiful summery glow. It's actually the middle of winter right now, but the end result of the Aero Liquid Gold, it's really sun-kissed, glowy, dewy. Like, look at that. Can you see that highlight? I love it. Okay, lovers, that was my personal tanning routine with the Aero Liquid Gold. I am Sarah's Day. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give this video a like and make sure you subscribe for some more tanning tips.